Welcome. This is how you can fix the BNC code. This is the BNC code of your camera CCTV and your power cord to your ROG59 cable. This cable has both the power and the video. Now this is a Quasar cable. Quasar cable for video. Then this one is the normal cable for power. That's positive and negative. Then this is Quasar cable, the one using your antenna. We are going to fix this one for the video. Then this one for the power. So give power to the camera. Normally the way the camera works is that when you connect this part of the wire to the box to the power supply, it sends power to the camera. So when the camera has power, it starts recording. The recorded videos is sent back through this other end of the camera to the Quasar cable. Then it records on the hard disk in the camera DVR. Now we are going to learn how to fix the BN. This is what called BNC. The video cable for cameras is called BNC. Then this is the power cable. I have a couple of them to fix, but I'm going to use one to demonstrate so that you can understand how it is done. I'll just take one out. First, I'll go with the BNC. Now, you need to understand that there are different types of BNCs. I prefer to use this one because it's easy and quick. You can fix it quickly. There's the one that you need to lose and use your screwdriver to fix it. This one, you don't need a screwdriver. What you need is a plier and just a tape to tape it around. I'm going to show you how to fix this particular type. First of all, what you do, take the plier, just uh, tear it out a bit. Like this. Extend the tearing to this level. Then trip this one off. Now, whenever you see black, you just use black as a negative. This negative with some in some cables you see red and black some you see white and black black is always constant as negative whatever other color you see is to be used as a positive the positive is connected to the till the top of the i will show you later just peel this one off peel it off then after spreading this already 59 cable this is the coaxial parts for the video i'm fixing this one first if you have a crimpy tool like this, you can use it to quickly open it. Okay. I do it one more time. Okay. Yeah. Now this part of the cable is the negative part. Then this is a shield, cable shield, to prevent the negative from having any contact with this positive side. Then there's the positive side. Use a plier to peel it out and get access to it. It's as simple as positive to negative. So positive to positive and negative to negative. Now, first of all, connect the negative tie. The way you tie your normal electrical cable, tie it properly, just twist it, twist it, twist it properly, then use your tape, use your tape to seal, to seal. Then after that, next. Connect the positive. Connect the positive to ensure that the connection is good. Just try to use a screwdriver or a flat substance to peel the copper shielding off to ensure that your connection is well established. Then at this point, you can connect, tie it around. Tie it around, bend it, and as well, use the tape. Tape it round again. At this point, you can take this one up and tape everything fully. Okay. 
is how to connect the BNC BNC cord or the BNC connector. After you're done with the BNC, then move over to the power. The power is straightforward. It's just like the way you connect your sockets for electrical systems. Tear it up. Same thing. Pretty straightforward. I'll take out one of the cable, one of the connectors to demonstrate. Tear it apart. It's red to red, black to black. This way, if you have a good plier, it will help you save time. On no account to use your mouth to peel the wires, it's not advisable. If a good plier saves you a lot of time and it makes your work neat. Red to red, tie, and as well, black to black, also tie. After tying, take your tape and seal both of them in the same vein, just like this. Seal both of them. Then the other side, seal it. Seal it. Normally, when you have you have this kind of connection at the terminal point of your camera. This is what you connect to your camera. Now, at this point, this is the female and this is the male. Your camera has a male connector. The one you connect is the female. You can join it together. There's a power. This one sends power to your camera. Then the video comes from here back into this one to the BNC to the DVR recorder. These are this, these are the connection is at the camera end. Normally, all these connections and cables will be placed inside a box a sizable adaptable box for all these then you can fix the camera on top of the box or on the wall that's for that i'm going to do a separate video on how to fix your camera watch out for that then if you are not subscribed yet make sure you subscribe then this other end you are only going to connect a bnc to this other end the same way i connected the first bnc connect the bnc to this end you have the BNC art piece on your DVR. These are go in there. You can have up to four channels, eight channels, depending on the number of channels you have. This one will go in there. Then for this, the power supply most times it's it requires you to just open it, then screw to positive and negative. You use a screwdriver, put the positive and negative on the respective ports and tighten it. You don't need any power connector on the DVR side. Because this side it comes from the DVR to the camera. As you mean this DVR is the camera side. Everything on the camera side is done. Then the DVR side you need have to connect the BNC. Then the power connects to the power supply box using a screwdriver. In a separate video, I'm going to show you that. But for now, I think we're done with this video. Thank you very much for following me. Thank you for liking my video. Thank you for sharing. See you in the next video. Until then, keep subscribing and stay safe. Peace.